you're anything like me and you often struggle with heartburn or indigestion, then you have probably tried numerous over-the-counter medications and nothing's really worked. If this is the case and you often struggle with heartburn and acid reflux, um, you have to try this smoothie that I'm going to share with you today because it's been a keeper of mine for many months now and uh, I cannot wait for you to try it so keep watching. So the first thing you're going to need to do is to brew one cup of herbal tea, uh, make sure it's caffeine free. I personally love using chamomile. Stir it for a minute or so and then you're going to need to cool it completely before we begin. Alrighty, so my tea has cooled and now we're going to begin adding our ingredients in a blender. Today I'm using a Nutribullet 600. The first ingredient you're going to need is one cup of frozen banana slices, two to three slices of cucumber, a handful of baby spinach, half a teaspoon of minced ginger root, a tablespoon of oats, uh, make sure you watch it till the end because I will be leaving some substitution ideas. And finally, our cooled uh, herbal tea. Now blend for two to three minutes, depending on the power of your blender, or into smooth and creamy. And there we have it guys, the smoothie comes in under five minutes and uh, make sure you drink it as soon as it's blended and uh, from personal experience, it starts to relieve my symptoms within 30 minutes to an hour. So make sure you watch till the end now because I will be leaving some optional ingredient substitutions um, should you want to change anything. Thank you so much for watching until the end. Um, so here are some ingredient substitutions and swaps you can make. So for a banana free smoothie, you can use melon instead, preferably frozen for the similar texture that the banana gave my smoothie. Uh, fresh is fine, but you will need to reduce the herbal tea to half a cup instead of one cup. And instead of herbal tea, you can use low-fat dairy milk. Milk has soothing effects and loads of people use it. Um, that is only possible if you are not dairy-free. You can substitute the oats for chia seeds or a handful of nuts, which are also just as good for acid reflux as the oats. And finally, if you don't have ginger, you can use one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. Make sure it's with the mother or alternatively, if you simply don't have a fresh ginger root, you can use half a teaspoon of dried ginger. Thank you so much for watching. I truly hope this smoothie helps you because it certainly helps me. Have a fantastic day, guys. Bye.